Confucian. What happened after man died? That is the separation of body and the soul. The body stopped functioning and the soul departed from the body. This is called first the death. God first created the human body from the dust. Then he breathed the breath of life into the person's nostrils. In other words, he breathed the spirit into them like a filling of balloon with the air. The spirit and the soul are responsible for thinking, feeling emotions, remembering, and other mental and spiritual activities. But after Adam sinned, the spirit in human died. The soul took over, and from then on, humans were made up of body and soul. For those who repent of their sins and accept the Lord, their once dead spirit is brought back to life. They become whole again, made up of spirit, soul, and body. When a person dies, the body stops functioning, and the spirit and the soul leave the body. The body may be cremated or buried, eventually turning to dust, but the spirit and the soul do not disappear. They go before God for judgment. This judgment is based on what the Bible says. Everything we've done, said, or even thought will be judged by the God. Nothing will be hidden before God. People who remain in sin will be sentenced to death according to God's law. The wages of sin is death. This is called the second death, and it leads to hell. But those who have been forgiven over their sins will be saved and go to heaven. This is what we call salvation. That's why it is so important to ask for forgiveness for our sins while we are still alive. In conclusion, when a person dies, the spirit and the soul are separated from the body. The body returns to dust and the spirit and the soul face judgment before God.